Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Vase Plays EU4. So, we had a, I don't even know what you want to call what we did to Russia. It wasn't very successful, but that's okay. No garads in the military coalition, so that's all that matters to me. Um, Novgorod wants in. Do they have a war? Oh, they're back to war with, um... Interesting. Well, hopefully they won't take these three counties. So, Muscovy wants it. No. <laughs> no, I, I don't think so. You, you can fuck right off, quite frankly. Yeah, no, fuck you. You don't... You don't get anything. Ryazan, huh? They're at war with Kazan. Not like they can reach there, but... Um, Lithuania wants military access. Sure. You hate me. Uh, Peshkov wants it. Nope. Poland wants it. Sure. You, uh, you rivaled us. I'd, I'd just like to point that out. Are you still in the military? You still are. What silly people... I'm in the military coalition against you. Why? Well, because you fucked me over. Well, fuck you back, man. Yeah, we're losing... Jesus Christ. We are losing so much money because... of, uh... reinforcing our men. That is great. We, we lost so much in this war against Russia. Look, all I want to do is be able to go take Perm, who is also at war with Muscovy. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> I guess they just decided that uh, there was enough people, because I'm pretty sure Lithuania... They must have just been... They must, oh, in Crimea. They must just be capitalizing in on um, all the goodies. We'll see what Novgorod does. But yeah, hopefully they'll, they'll, they'll take a few bites out of these assholes. I should probably stop trying to support their air... Support our air. France is asking um, abolish attacks. Shh. Um, I mean, we can't say no, but we don't have to get involved, so. We failed that mission, unfortunately, because that's just how this game is going to go. Uh, claim Kolgrimi, which I'm pretty sure we're doing. Yeah, so, that'll be easy. Yeah, we're reinforcing so slowly. Oh, <laughs> really? On this? Well, Brandenburg, if you if you think you can do it, then um, more power to you. I openly and and eagerly embrace your um, desire to take my try to take my land. Um, who's your allies? Brunswick. Oh, well, you've got Austria, but Austria is our ally too, so. Oh, England's involved, huh? Oh, they actually, um... Cool. The music just stopped. Um... Covert, fabricate claim on... Oh, I'm just gonna fabricate claim on all of it. Because fuck Russia. Basically, oh, they're actually sieging some of my islands. Um, I'm not too worried about that. This is a war against uh, Portugal. Hungary didn't. So, curious as to how that all um, operated. But um, yeah, France is actually going to move through and just siege the shit out of Portugal. England's the leader, however. So, we can separate peace. And uh, make them happier, but that, that's okay. Still need hey hungry, oh hungry, hungry is really happy. Um, once oh yeah, we should probably stop. Like I said, um, I was trying to see how this was going. We are. Where? Oh, seven, yeah. Uh, relations, nope, it's uh, dynastic actions. Neat, neat how they allow you to do that, though. 
I like that. Um, Zygmond Landcaster, Royal Marriage, send. Awesome. Now, it'll become a problem if they decide to try and cross, and we're losing less money, which is good. Um, oh yeah, we should also kick out one of you guys, there you go. So that we can, uh, um, yeah, they took Orkenny, Kenny, but, um, that's fine with me. So. It was all in the military coalition against us. Um, Pomerania and the Hansa. Okay, good to know. We are slowly getting our, our men back. We need 18,000. And, jeez, that's crazy. So, yeah. Um. Oh, here comes 11 English men, actually. So that sucks, right? Um, not exactly what I wanted to have to deal with, but um, I, I guess that's just the way that's going to go. I really wish they hadn't done that. Um, they have 37 ships compared to our, like... You just, yeah, you come here for now. I can't have you protecting trade. Oh, this sucks. Come on, take some of their land, Crimea. Income from vassals. We don't really have any, but we might. Oh, they're dropping more. God damn it, England. I really hope you're winning, France. Because you can't really do much. That's very frustrating. Okay, let's go take them out. It's gonna... Tank us. Fuck me. Um, We need to put down... Fleet maintenance. There we go. We saved ourselves from... Having to worry about that. Oh, there goes some of our ships. Yep, there you go. I'll be able to build it back later. As you know. Of course, we have a river crossing. But hopefully... Oh, they're going to send 19 more men in. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Nope, we have to, we have to go back. That's really unfortunate. I don't want to break my alliance with France, but I don't fucking want to get involved in this damn war with England. Is they're, they're focusing just on me. Oh, that's not far enough, apparently. So. I know it's cheap, but fuck France, man. Our royal marriage won't end, so that's nice. Why did they even go to war with Britain anyway? Oh, Britain got called in because... Right, um, nope. Sorry, France. I know you're pissed off. They have a good point. Yep, sorry, France. Can't, can't do it. Fuck you. Um, covert actions, nope. Um, dynastic actions, there we go. Sorry, France, but I'm not not necessarily concerned with uh, your your politics. I, w I would like to keep uh, England happy. It may not happen. We may actually have to go to war with England at some point, but... It would be hilarious if I could uh, claim the throne. It's not going to happen, but it would be really funny. Alliance... That's not the button I wanted. Alliance. They would take an alliance, actually. Which would actually help us against uh, Poland. So, that's cool. Offer alliance, send. Cool. How does Austria feel about that? Eh, yeah, they're pretty pissed off. 
Um, and we are, again, losing money, and that just means that I'm going to um, lower our naval. Um, we gained a cause conquest against them. Oh, we're still losing money, but less, so that's good. Um, I'm going to start claiming more. Really wish we had been called into the, uh, into the coalition. Oh, and we didn't get that, uh, cost, that, uh, mission. That's fine. Um. What is Perm doing? Oh, they're actually losing. Which is a shame. I doubt they're involved in, in this, so. Who knows. Who knows. Russia might be getting their shit rocked. If this war can go on for another four or five years, then um, I will definitely join in again. You can bet your bottom dollar about that. Yeah, stupid NPCs. We have, a we have a military that's twice as large as what we actually have as our force limit. And we're still making tons of money because we're the NPCs and we know how to do everything correct. I believe the word is fuck you, game, for that. So. I hope Russia just gets eaten alive. <laughs> yeah, they. this is their land, man. This is this is their land. You only, only take one or two provinces, but what, every, every province you take, you know, as far as I'm concerned, every province you take, the happier I am. I can't believe Perm's not, or, yeah, I can believe Perm's not doing anything, but I wish they were. Hopefully, maybe this time. Um, I don't really care about how you feel about that. We should also work to um, get these changed. I thought we did that in the last, the last war. Um, old Prussian. Eh, we'll, we'll worry about it later. We're making a little bit less money because of it, but that's okay. Fuck you, Poland. Yeah, France is actually in a lot of trouble against Burgundy. They, they may become a power eventually, but... And if they do, then we might actually be in trouble because they're going to have tons and tons of men. But at that point, we may well be able to uh, have a ton of settlers. So that'll be cool. That'll be neat. I'll like that. I'm hoping they take some land. That's all I can say. And this should hurt everybody involved. So, uh, it should hopefully make us a little bit stronger. Novgorod hasn't taken any land. I wouldn't mind seeing Novgorod grow a little bit stronger. Like I said, if they could take these two, be happy about that. Like I said, I'm not necessarily looking for all of, of Russia's land. I'm just looking for, you know, this stuff right here. These, 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 these ones so I can get to perm. Don't even care about, uh, Viat Viatka. Not really. Anything to keep Muscovy small and, and weak and scared. I want I want the, the uh, Muscovite peasants to uh, f tell stories about us in the night. About the, da the Danes. Just, you know, obviously Denmark. <laughs> I want them to be like, yeah, you remember them? They're cr they were fucking crazy. They came in like a bat out of hell. Are, are we, yeah, I was going to say, are we not? Uh... There we go. Doesn't really matter. How the vassal goes, that's fine. Um, um, I guess we'll try to take fabricate claim on Marenburg. I guess. Doesn't look like uh, aggressive expansion exists anymore with Poland, which is cool. Certainly does for uh, Lithuania, though. They're they're pretty po'd. So, um, yeah, it's going to take a long time. Oh, actually, it's it's down. It's actually 20,000 or 10,000 less than I, I, I last thought it saw it at. So, um, any, okay, ooh, no, uh, they actually took some. That, you, you guys suck. You really do. I mean, trust me. I know how, how much it, it fucking blows to, um, Novgorod discovered that, Oh, we have discovered that Novgorod canceled military access. Are they out of the war? Oh, they did they get a new land? I think they did. 
I think they actually took a little bit more land. Which is great. Novgrad actually pieced out. Or did they? No. No, they didn't. They didn't take any land. Well, you're stupid. Poor Novgorod. Poor Novgorod. They're allied with Poland, unfortunately. So, if, if we declare war on them, that's going to be a, a pain in the ass for us. So. Um, Crimea's coming up. Yeah, I really don't know what's going to come of this. Perm's literally not doing anything. Oh, Muscovy just lost. I wish I could come in on this. I would. I'd fucking jump into this war and, and just beat them down. Fabricate a claim on Kexholm. Yeah. Trust me. I'm, I'll, I'll take as much land as I'm able to. I really will. <laughs> it'll, it'll be done. Uh, oh, we actually can... That's what we did. We converted this stuff to... Uh, to... No, we didn't. I didn't... I guess I just didn't convert any. Oh, well. Um... That sucks. Is they're apparently really strong. <sighs> I know it's cheating. I don't care. <laughs> Fuck it. Maybe. I was gonna say, don't crash on me. Thank you. Fuck you. Five. We have a higher mil, uh, higher attack rate than you do. Um, fuck, I'll just, uh, yeah, there you go, I lost 25 legitimacy, everyone should be happy that I got paid back for that. <laughs> and we are still gaining men, it's down 3,000 since last I checked, so, oh shit, go perm, go, go, take as much land from these assholes as you can. The more land you take, the more land I'm taking from you. Nope, fuck you. Yeah, you you don't understand. <laughs> you you really don't. Um ooh, missionary strength. I will take that. Um Yeah. Once we reach ten we'll be we, we will immediately foreign Scandinavia. I don't know what it does. Um let's see. Uh national revolt risk goes up by one. Weird. But national tax modifier goes up and we gain some prestige. Not a whole lot, really. If I if I had to no. <laughs> no, you're not. You're not uh cool. Uh, we will convert. We'll take eighty three months. But uh we're here. Who's who else is here? Lithuania? Why do you have Yeah, you're They've they've Zero war score. Oh no, fifty-one. There you go. Um, conquest costs Belli. We just, I just want it. That's all I care about. So I just, I just want it. Um, yeah, that's unfortunately. Oh well. Um, yeah. There we go. And we got two more years. An 11. It's 11. It's so stupid. Yeah, it's 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 awful. I really hate that. Not much I can do about it, unfortunately. I mean, we're just we're going to have religious zealots here. That's just the way of things. Active missionary. Oh fuck! I don't care. Active missionary is plus six. Did that get changed? Intolerance. Oh, Pomerania left the coalition against us. Good. Intolerance? Do we really have that bad of intolerance? Yeah, I guess we do. Our king died, and we have a regency. Damn it. How old is our, our kid? Oh, well, fuck it. We'll be fine. We'll be getting a base five. We have three military leaders? Oh, yes, we do, actually. And for some reason, we can only have you know, uh, no leader. There you go. Sorry, dude. You're out. And we just have to soak up the, the minus one 
um, which is going to help. There's negative stability. Oh, and war exhaustion. Um, definitely isn't helping us any. Um, I wish I could reduce it, but it's going down. It goes down, you know, considerably each month, so. Which is good. That'll, that'll help. Um, yeah, negative stability is a plus two, which sucks. Um, but yeah, totally. Oh, no, I understand, um, having, having it so high. It's, it sucks. There's nothing you could, we can do about it right now. But, um, Austria declared war on Burgundy. Uh, there's a huge world war going on right now, I guess. <laughs> I mean, really, uh, world, world war one is, is going on right now. And we're just kind of sitting here staring at the, at the, the ceiling, essentially. What's, what's going on, guys? Everyone, everyone, uh, copacetic? Everyone having a good day? Everyone having fun? Oh, why, why is everyone yelling and screaming at each other? Oh. Okay. Yeah, we need a hundred. So, we'll get it. We'll get it. Five, five, and eight. Whoa! Military is going up pretty high, but that's because they have a plus four. Um, and they're gonna stop that from happening. So this, this revolt risk will go down once we get more exhaustion out. Oh, Perm, uh, Perm left the, the war. They didn't take anything. It just hurts Muscovy. And we have a year, and we will, will be returning. Especially once this is done. But, oh, rest assured. Rest assured, we are going, we're going back in. We're going back in. And I will, uh, I will step on them. I will step on their face. Forever. And again, we only have to take two. Because per perm is still there, so I, I, if I can, we may not be able to. <laughs> I mean, I, I guess I'll take Arkhangelsk as well, just so that we have, you know, an un uninterrupted coastline. But, um, yeah, that that really sucks. <laughs> They're at sixty, so that's almost done. Um, there are, here we go, our ruler is here, personal, really, succession war between Bavaria and, um, oh, um, we're the Papal Controller, that's hilarious, um, okay, um, we need to get our, our royal marriages back, not gonna happen with them, dynastic royal marriage, Marriage. Real marriage. Done. Great. Um, alliance. They don't want an alliance because of their opinion toward us, but that's okay. I just wanted to... How about you? Nope. Ottomans are growing. Um, Croatia, Croatia formed. Hey, look at that. Uh, yeah, the Ottomans are gonna be a problem. For sure. They are, they're gonna be a pain in the ass. Um, Burgundy doesn't want a real marriage. Castile doesn't want a real marriage because this is between borders. Portugal doesn't want a, or Aragon? Nope. Okay. Um, Lithuania doesn't want a real marriage. Poland's not gonna want a real marriage. No one, no one wants a real marriage with us, man. Scotland? Scotland. They'll totally take a royal marriage. They'll even take vassalization. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. I'm... I, I mean, it, it's going to be really bad because England is very big. And we don't have a lot of boats. We'll we'll have more boats. We know what they can throw at us. I guess we'll send a guy to improve relations on the 14th of October. This war is still going on. That makes me happy. So we'll send it here in two days, improve relations. We should probably end the episode here soon. But, um... Yeah, once that's done... We might actually start going to war with um, England. We'll actually have a, well, what's important here is we'll actually have a base of operations if we can um, 
annex them. Or, yeah, if we can annex them, shit. Yeah, we'll have total, total control. Um, oh, yeah, we should uh, improve our, our stability. And we should have a 25% chance to get an air. 20. That's weird, but we should have a 25, but whatever. Oh, no, 20. They're, they're right. Um, when is our truce expired? Um, truce is expired on the 4th of April. Okay, but that's probably when we'll end the episode. Um, but not a big deal, because we're just going to, you know, cross the border. Oh, we had attrition... Is of the winter. Gold is a sign of nobility. Nobility cannot be bought. Fuck yes. Wish I hadn't spent the money on posit on that, but um, positive stability is good. We're gonna lose the last the co oh shit. Novgorod exploded. That sucks. I mean, it it, it sucks for us. It doesn't suck for for uh, Novgorod. Holy crap! They got a lot of land back. Poland. Yep, I, I figured. They already canceled theirs. Um, well, then I guess we're gonna go to war with these guys. And, uh, we've already seen how they fight, so... Um... It's unfortunate. Oh, we got a new... There we go! Succession is safe. Which is nice. Just in a bigger army. Yes. Um, so, yeah. Okay. And what that means is we are going to be able to to link up some of our land. Da Danzig is still kind of fucked, but you know, okay. So we'll save here, and then uh, tomorrow we will declare war on our most hated enemies, Novgorod. <laughs> no, uh, but for real, um, I'm I'm taking it. I'm taking it to, uh, the dickheads in Muscovy. So, as always, ladies and gentlemen, 